is an overflow drain. Here, this is your primary drain. As you can tell, what happens is when the condensate fills up in this pan, the water will flow through here, flow out, and go into where it either exits the house. Being we're in a basement, it's going into your condensate pump. Because we're below grade, we mechanically have to pump this water out because your system is actually below the grade outside. But what happens is there's really no easy way to get inside here to flush that pan. So I brought some stuff with us today to show you why this is here. One thing that they're gonna do is, right now you can see this is an overflow. This is only used if the, the drain pan itself cannot get the water out. Using that in another means is we're able to forcefully pour water in and flush this out. Um, the system's running right now. What this union is here for is that gives us a chance to look inside there and look and see if there's any debris blocking the exit of this drain. So anytime that you see this, this union is here to open up the drain to allow us access to look inside. But let's just show you real quick. That's what, we build this this way, now it kind of makes sense. It's hard to pour that. You got a lot of electrical controls here. We don't want to be pouring water all down inside the controls. That's the reason for the extension, the pump, a funnel here. What we're doing now is this is a steady drill. Very slow to fill up, very slow to come out. Pressure washer. Basically what we're doing is we're just putting a little bit of force behind the water as it goes in. What we did now was we just manually poured water in, back flushed the pan. That allows for drainage to come out through here. We'll and I can ahead. hear the condensate pump already starting. Mm -hmm. And you can, like I say, as we're going through here, Water's going in. Any debris that builds up on here, we're washing it off. Plus, we're taking fresh water out of the faucet, pouring it through there. This is warm water, mm -hmm. so as it goes through, it's clean. No bleach or any of that? No, 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 no bleach, just regular water. And as this goes through, remember we were talking about you had a condensate pump. This is draining all the way over here. And it comes down, here's, here's your condensate pump itself. What this is doing is, Water's draining into here, so we'll just check it right quick. We're gonna slide this out of the way. Right. Now, I'll let you do it. All right, thank you. There's the funnel. Now you can see the way this is coming out. Now, is it gonna function with that uh, switch off or? Yeah, This is. we're just gonna watch the flow of the water as it comes through. Okay. Now you can see the steady, how it comes through, but as that water starts to come back, you'll see the See the difference? Mm -hmm. See how the flow just picked up? Mm -hmm. What we're wanting to do is we're wanting to look at that and make sure we have a good, a good steady flow of water coming out. You can tell that from where it exits the drain all the way back to here, we're doing okay. Seems pretty clean. Yeah, and that's because we flushed it. Mm -hmm. Doing this periodically every year is going to make sure that stays clear. Okay. 